How's it going guys? Maybe Stash here. Um, what I want to go over with you today is we're going to take a look at how to improve your leg lower movement here. Uh, the leg lower is a great way for you to re-establish the proper uh, internal and external rotation of your leg bone using your breath and learning how to get your keeper core to stay activated while you're moving. So uh, I usually show this with a strap underneath your back. We're thinking about that rib cage staying down, that back staying flat to make sure that that strap isn't going anywhere. But oftentimes, if you have a lot of problems keeping this leg going in line, like it's so tight, that just simply internally rotating your legs so if these are proper alignment, it's killing you and it's painful or you're really weak there. You can also use another strap. I'm just gonna take this one out here and I'm gonna throw this thing out around my foot. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna assist yourself on this one. So from right here, I'm gonna take my deep breath in filling my tummy up by the strap here to check and make sure that it was flat. I'm going to slowly lower that leg down as low as I can under control. When I'm down here at the bottom, I'm going to take a look and make sure that it's in good alignment. I want to make sure the leg isn't tipping over. I want to make sure that that leg bone is pointing straight up. I'm going to take another breath in there and I'm going to use that lower core muscles and I'm going to use this strap to assist myself to bring that thing all the way up. You look from this angle here what you'll see is as that leg comes down further and further, this is going to want to dump out off to the side. Well, we don't want that thing to go to the side, so we're going to work on taking that leg bone, your femur here, rotating it internally, getting a breath there to press save on the Word document so your brain remembers that this is the right spot for it to be. It takes it out of the uh, threatening movement list and it says, oh, this isn't so bad after all. That's so why we want to get that breath at the bottom each time. Then I'm going to use my muscles here to try to raise it up. I'm going to use the strap just to assist that. So again, if you're really struggling with stopping your legs from being out here, just simply try and put that thing in line is a lot of work. But what you can do is, uh, I'll be going over more of this later in the week, but how to release and open up those external rotators that are pulling your legs out, and how to get those internal rotators to turn on better to maintain that position. So again, you always have to work from the bottom and work your way on up. If something's too difficult and it's uncomfortable or causes pain, you need to back up and regress that movement to make it a little bit easier so it becomes more effective. We practice that stuff every day. Always feel free to reach out with any questions you may have. You guys make it a great day.